Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome to Turner Warped, episode number 30. Welcome, welcome. If mature language is not your thing, this is probably the time to leave because we have several immature people here that will be using some very mature language, possibly hand gestures, possibly uh, signage, um, maybe visual aids. I'm not sure. But there's going to be things that uh, just shake you to your very core. And if you're not prepared for those things, this is not the place for you. Welcome, though, to the people that do want to stay, that do enjoy those things. Hello. Hello. How's everyone doing? Hello. Hello. Doing well. Sir, is there a tweet, sir? There is no tweet. Today has <gasps> been me, me, like, <laughs> running super late. Fuck Twitter. You had tweetless. One job, whack. One job. Uh, yeah, that's I, my favorite joke. I, whack I, had <laughs> one job. I've, I, I, I have literally, like, today Today has been, like, the latest day, like, ever for me. Like, and I and I woke up early. Like, I didn't wake up late. I just, I, I feel like I've been moving in slow motion all morning. Do you ever have those mornings? Oh, yes. yeah, every uh, single day. Every fucking yeah. day. Yeah. Literally that's, that's, every that's day. Life. I know what you mean, life. Yeah. That's yeah. a... It's, yeah, I, I, you're you're usually quite organized, aren't you, Wax? So this is this he's, just, he's, just, I'm never somehow, level. He somehow stays fairly organized, even with all the shit that he does. Like I do, like almost nothing, and I barely keep my head afloat. Yeah, Wax. Uh, that's kind of that's kind of gross. You should yeah. not. Very imp I'm, it's impressive. The rest of us look really bad. <laughs> yeah, I, I I've pretty much given up my schedule at the moment. Life is just. I love I love when 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 people like you get disappointed in in the rest of us normal people. We're like, oh, you didn't do your thing. And I'm like, well, yeah, because you're better than we are. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what? I wasn't, Just get wasn't over expecting it. that one. The way we went there. Yeah. Uh, oh, the quick thing too uh, regarding the luck whack. There were some upgrades to the luck in that errata from the yeah. critical hits, but there's a whole new slew of stuff in old that's probably just for Ooh. old but uh, I'll, I'll i'll show it to you anyway I'll, I'll luck is already broken as all oh, hell, dude, it's so. so much the things you can do with the luck die in <laughs> old are it's just there's so much more you can do i'll have to look it up yeah it's bro it's broken as fuck so i'm fine it's with so it not, broken not really yeah. like adding more to luck i'm good with yeah. that oh shit. man like i'm pretty sure we need to we need to add a bad luck component somehow <laughs> we need to yeah. throw that in there like you can use it at yeah I'll, just a few things you can add dice to any attribute check on a one-to-one -one basis you can do that anyway but you can deduct dice from someone else's attribute check on a one-to-one -one basis oh, right. add yeah. dice to a damage roll on a one-to-one -one basis yeah absorb the, damage that, that's on a in the errata that's in is the that errata. still is yeah. that the errata is yeah, that it's, it? it's in there i think pretty so sure. i remember it's, reading it's that not recently. in the critical hits errata it must have been in a previous year. Uh, it, no, it's in one of the ones that I linked you. I'm pretty sure it's previous. in the critical. I'm it, pretty it, it sure it's in the critical hits one. I, th I think it is. Uh, I'm going through. It. They have some things with luck die regarding like shaking conditions, but they don't have the the extra uses in there. Uh, see I'll, now, I'll, I'll go through the old erratas and see if I can see now. Up. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna throw this tweet out, and I love using this animated GIF, and I know that this. <laughs> I, I love using this one because the astronaut that's in it looks like I imagine Tuesday would look if she was in space. What the fuck? This is, this is my... See this. <laughs> it's, I've used it before, but that's what I imagine Tuesday would look like Are you doing like this because I've only got one screen? Yes. Ah. <laughs> Screaming. Oh, it's funny because it's true. Screaming in the vacuum of space. Yep. Dying a slow death. And I... <laughs> And what kind of shoes is she wearing? Like, I think those are like... <laughs> Wait, what is that shoe situation? Like, are they flip-flops? Got... They're the Mary Jane Keens. <laughs> I actually have those. <laughs> that, honestly, honestly, if you told us that that was literally you, I probably wouldn't You'd believe buy it. it. I probably would Because the face is so, con it's so contorted and, like, there so expression, are. so much expression, that it, it could be you. Yeah. I, 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 I legit thought that was Tuesday when I first saw this tweet. I'm oh like, holy God. shit. Tuesday's got a Tuesday's got a Tuesday fucking was. animated She's like is, is that me? Wait, is that me? I can't do I own an actual Oh awesome, my chair is breaking. Oh this is space good. onesie. Oh. So, yeah. We're having a great day so far. <laughs> this is a weird day. What's, what's breaking? My what? chair is breaking. It's I'm sitting on like a corner That's couch awesome. thing. So 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 if wax suddenly disappears. I'm gonna like slowly keep like getting shorter like on the camera, like Oh, Ooh, wow. sectionals. Sectional couches are the greatest couches. Yeah, yeah. Known to yeah. This is awesome. yeah they are. They're yeah. awesome. Why are you not in the corner with your feet up, Peachy? Right? Um, because oh, yeah, there's USB fucking... ports in the wall. Uh, 
Thank you. Um, yeah. Oh, wall SP. <laughs> I mean, this, I got this plugged in there. It's great. It's great. That is awesome. Yeah, so oh, yeah, I, 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 I just can't lean back for the entire show. I and mean, then I'm oh, good. Oh, not a problem. <laughs> it's, it, feels like, it feels like one of those like those exercise ball uh, chairs yeah. that people yeah, 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 yeah. try to balance. I, yeah, I kind of have to balance right now. That's that's it's good for the I'm gonna my abs are gonna be done after the show. It's just yeah, gonna ab, ab workout it's gonna in for a little. It's gonna be the ab workout. It's cool. What's cool. old oh, is new? That's awesome. It's a, it's another thing that I really just can't afford. It's fine. <laughs> it's good. Yeah, yeah it's just <laughs> another thing that's not in the budget. Yeah, my my new chair. The only chair I have is slightly too narrow. So I'm just stuck with it. So it's oh, like I'm gonna no. do, I'm gonna deal with it. Either that or I break the fucking arms off of the thing. There you go. One of the two. <laughs> Yeah, I gave oh up, I gave up on the arms on this chair a while ago. I was like smashing them every time I got mad in a game, and I'm like, you know what? Let's just <laughs> you remove. Just need to go. <laughs> let's remove the violent component here. Let's just. Yeah, that's let's the get source the hacksaw. Of, yeah. And yeah. Let's just so, deal with this. Oh now I God. just punch microphones, right, Zagonicus? There's so much dog hair. What is my life? <laughs> you know, sometimes they look at you wrong. I want to get a dog. I still want to get a dog. Rick. So how's everybody doing? How is how are your weeks, guys? How are your weeks? Did you good. have good weeks? Super good. Dave. Illness and bad luck. That uh, sounds about right. Typical yeah. week for me, really. Mine was awesome. Bad. I saw John Wick finally. Dude, oh, yes. so good. Which are you one? Not first one? Or second this one? Oh, I'm man. This is so one, good. So These are like my favorite one. movies now. They're so good. Oh, <laughs> I love them. Awesome. Like the three, the three ultimate spy hero dudes would be Bond, John Wick, and Bourne. Bond yeah. would be the first one you send in. Then it'd be What's Wick. What's the new British one? Oh, uh, uh, Just fucking. Back. No, it's, uh, <laughs> I know the one you're talking about. I can't but there's a new one coming about. out, and that looks really cool. Guilds, as well. not like, Guildsman. Like yeah, Kingsman. Kingsman, Kingsman. 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 that's it. Oh, Kingsman. Have you not seen the first Kingsman feature? No, first Kingsman. Oh my god. That was one of the best scenes. I watched like four movies a year. Yeah. Has, the and, first Kingsman has, has some of the best cinematography in a in a movie, at least for f in one of the fight this. scenes ever. Yeah, it's so Kingsman's good. Kingsman's really good. Really I did see all two minutes of Castlevania. Anyone else see Ooh, all two minutes the of anime? the Netflix Castlevania? I, it was, yeah, it was little, good. Blurb, that it, little, yeah. it was yeah. good. It was only, little, what, four episodes, though? Yeah, yeah four it was episodes. literally oh. 120 minutes. Sure. Yeah. All right. Here's, did everyone yeah. see the new Et trailer? No. Yes, I did. Oh my fucking no! god! The trailer's out. Holy yep. shit, dude! It's out. And my I'm... god, it's it's an incredible. Is it coming out trailer. around Halloween? Um, no. I can't no. remember. I was just so blown away by the actual trailer. I didn't see the part oh, about oh, the dance oh, oh, and shit. Oh. But the trailer is creepy as fuck. Oh, I've watched the trailer. Really I I don't like scary films at all. Um, like you I think should... we made it for like three episodes into into Stranger Things, and I was just like. No, but it's mostly amazing. because, right? Mostly because. Don't forget, I live with a troll. Oh yeah, Bo he was, will mess yeah, you with Bo, you. Bo was He'll just like there. Wouldn't it be really bad if you woke up and it was just my severed arm? There? You know, I would, yeah. I would, I would literally not only assault somebody if they did that to me. Yeah. I would break up with them on the spot. If yeah, pulled <laughs> like that's it. That's, <laughs> that, that's how I. That's how Holy I live my life. So, I can't handle that. With that so shit. Bobby, if Bobby, gonna wake me up. Someone's gonna wake me up like. My arm's falling off. I was like, okay, your arm's obviously yeah, not you're off. Out. You can you can move now. Start packing you're your out. bags. <laughs> Start packing it. It's your over. stuff. Bobby's oh, literally oh, advising you to break up with Bob Fuzzy. Like, Bob has always been a troll. Can't He's do always, it. You know, I, I'm, he, that's how I met him. He came into a chat and trolled me. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh, you're so funny and annoying, but funny. And, <laughs> <laughs> and, and you have a Scottish it. accent. And oh, right. Okay. And you're interesting. Yeah. Oh, that, that's, I mean, it, it's good that you guys have, you guys got the bond, but like, I some people, it's, it's just how it goes to show everybody's different with those yeah. guys. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. He, he does occasionally push it too far, and then I have to, you know, sit him yeah, down. Yeah, but then you get him back, though. To reel them back in, yeah. Mrs. Z does that with me sometimes. Speaking of like, real, <laughs> reeling people back in, <laughs> let's let's. Uh, Speaking of yeah, <laughs> let, let's uh, let's actually maybe get started with the show because we'll just bullshit for the next two hours, like oh, no yeah. problem. Yeah. I can do that. Look, yeah. look. All I said was I watched John Wick. That's it. <laughs> yeah, I know, and all that's, that's, that's all, all it takes. takes. Listen, sometimes me with I good do. friends, Peachy. That's all that's, that matters. That's, all, <laughs> that's it. That's I all you outside, need there, bud. I went outside the day before yesterday and met new people. No. What? <gasps> are you okay? Who are you? Is is are you an alien? Who are no. you? No, it, it's just Bob, Bob was hanging out with a couple of his mates from work, and he was like, "Do you want to come along?" And I'm like, "Yeah." 
People? 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 Speaking of meeting that. new people, let's nah. meet the current people that are on oh, the stream of Stram. Let's go. Let's meet the crew <laughs> with updated screen for for our new our new crew member, uh, Sturdy. Wait, am I first? I made this. Bobby. What? It's your first go. Oh. <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm actually Bobby Foyle here on Twitch. Uh, I'm not Peachy Pixelate. Uh, and uh, yeah, follow me on Twitch I'm if lucky. you want to do that. I'm lucky. I, don't, I mean, we're all just all differences. Just slight little differences. I'm Canadian. I'm a ginger. You're from over there. I'm, I'm Swedish. You're Swedish. I think we're all Swedish at the end of the day. Yeah, I just down, don't like literally all over myself. Well, I have enough salmiaki to oh. make me Swedish right now. I'm covered in Swedish right now. I literally just spilled like <laughs> a huge amount of tea all over myself. Anyway, I play Felix the Dead Eye uh, pilot. The Dead Eye feeling Felix the pilot man. I'm a cat dude with a gun and a bad drug addiction. And... Uh, a, a malfunctioning liver, so we'll see what happens today. <laughs> I'm really out to get a new liver. Like that's like top priority. Felix. Top we'll priority. See. We'll see. Fuzzy. Why, hello there. I'm Fuzzy Freaks. I just realized I was I was crinkling things loudly whilst being unmuted as well. When has it stopped you before, Fuzzy? I, I usually try and mute before I do loud, crinkly things. But yes, my name is Fuzzy Freaks, and I am um, um, one and a half beers in t t to my evening. And um, I have large amounts of salmiaki because because I have Finnish friends. That means I'm going to be on a huge sugar buzz tonight, so that should be fun. Uh, recently, I have been playing uh, Citadel, Forged with Fire, which is good, but also broken because none of the mobs will attack at the moment, which I'm waiting for a patch. And I've been playing Dragon Age Origins because 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 hot Spanish elves. Why wouldn't you? Speaking of hot Spanish elves, Tuesday. <laughs> Hola, que tal? Me llamo Tuesday. Um, my name is Tuesday, and I haven't been streaming much lately, but I will be soon, so you should follow me anyway, and you should follow all these other awesome people as well. Today I will be pay playing Glix, who is a pseudo-medic science officer who really wants this $10 million. If you were not here last week, we have a chance to get $10 million if we can uh, rescue somebody from a hostage kidnapping situation uh alive what are dollars well. so uh so credits those 10 million credits though um they're they're probably tasty and we get a lot of could get a lot of pink jammies with them so let's get them pink jammies and the pinkest of jammies zagotagus hey everybody i'm zagotagus and i play the wonderful hawk who um who is a super valued member of the crew and uh, recently made them a ton of money and uh, is very stylish. So, uh, so yeah, there's that. <laughs> I think next week, I think on Tuesday, I'm going to start the Wolfenstein games because I haven't played them before and everyone's doing it, so I felt like I should do it. So I think I'll start that on Tuesday. Not, I can... But why do you have to be called Tuesday? Because that my brain immediately went, ha ha, joke. <laughs> but no. Uh, yeah. And then tomorrow, um, there's there's going to be Seventh Eon. So that's pretty much my plan for the next week. Role playing here and uh, killing Nazis. Maybe. Have fun too. Do, do we want to do the Nazi transition for Peachy? Is that is that where <laughs> we're at right now? Is that what we want to do? Is it got to, uh, it's, I was. Just I know if that was newest, his plan. <laughs> you you could do that because I was just watching the newest uh, season of Archer, which has a lot of Hitler. Okay. Speaking of Hitler, here's Peachy. Um, Jews. Something about Jews. Well, uh, got the red and black on and everything. Uh, I mean, I I actually have Jews. More. Am I right? What's the deal with that? Doesn't work because he. Oh God. Was, I'm Peachy. Seinfeld? Please get off the screen. Reference that's <laughs> the deal yeah. with Did you... Yeah. <laughs> Did you leave the oven on? <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. Stop it now. Get Jesus get Christ. This is supposed to be a, a literal joke of a of a transition, not <laughs> <pick up> and... <laughs> 
I, I am not at home <sighs> right now, uh, but I will be tomorrow and the rest of the week, so you can just watch me over on Twitch.tv. I play uh, Arthur. No, somebody killed him. It's like fucking Cluedo, because there's like 12 people who basically killed him. Not salty. I play Sterling Rhapsody. I said it right. You did. Congratulations. Congratulations. And I'm Mike Steven. I'm the GM of Doom. The Space Master, whatever you want to call me. I'm the guy that hath created the galaxy, galaxy, galaxy. And uh, I am the guy that will be dragging these guys kicking and screaming through the adventure today. And there may very well be some kicking and screaming. More often than not, there's kicking and screaming. I feel like that, that's it's, it's like a 75% you know, kicking and screaming to not kicking and screaming kind of situation that's happening. It's about the ratio, yeah. yeah. Most Sometimes there's just normal yelling. Yeah. Yeah, I, I do a lot of that. Yeah. And when I'm not here, Whack does it for me. <laughs> <laughs> that is the best Felix, impression of Tuesday. What are you talking about? Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do drugs, Felix! Pretty ah, <laughs> <laughs> it sounds so just like what? Eat a uh, what's the name bunker yeah. <laughs> uh, but yes um if you guys like what i do here uh i you you might notice that i have i have set up the the waxed dm emote um because that Twitch... is gorgeous by the way <laughs> thanks it, it, that is gorgeous <laughs> i was like holy shit what is that and then i moused over it like yes <laughs> Um, yes, that is that is my new email for the channel. Um, and, uh, yeah, if you like what I do here, please give me a follow, uh, twitch.tv slash waxsteven, and on Twitter, add waxsteven there. Um, tomorrow, we're going to have some um, new... Sh uh, the, the, well, it's not the premiere, but it's episode one of the seventh eon, so I'm really excited about that. And uh, I still have a lot of work to do before tomorrow. <laughs> I think that's why I've been in slow motion all morning. I feel like... I feel like I know how much work I have to do. My body's You're trying to get there slowly. Yeah, I am. To do. <laughs> my my body is just like, nope, nope. You got nope. you got so much. Just just slow just it down. Don't get there. Just slow yeah. it down, bud. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Uh. We we got some we got some uh, space operaizing to do today. Uh. That's that's okay. what we have. We've got uh. We've got some Woin RPG. This is the official channel of the What's Old Is New RPG for N E W. It's the um, let's see. What's old is new system, and uh, Bobby, I believe you got some you got some OLD stuff coming up soon, huh? Yeah, DMing yeah. my very first campaign. Hooray! DMing Yay! past past just DMing Hooray! my first campaign. DMing period ever. I've never DM'd a one shot. I've never DM'd for Woo! friends for fun for a half hour. It's just gonna. I'm just gonna dive right on into it, just like yep. my very first time playing D and D, which was like, it was the most one of the most stressful things. I had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> And I still don't know what I'm doing, and now I'm in control, and I have no idea what I'm doing. So I think That's it's awesome. going really well. I'm very excited. Welcome, when does it start? To the club. It starts on Tuesday night over on Brad, uh, Brad Wado's channel. Nice. Three, three o'clock Eastern. It, I and feel I just feel a little bit like disgusted advertising Brad's channel. Like yeah. I wish it was yours, then I wouldn't feel bad like at all. <laughs> when when we're advertising Brad's channel here, I throw up in my mouth a little bit. A little, little, puke, little tiny puke. Um, yeah. But no, it's it should be a lot of fun. I got a lot of work put into it, and Fucking it's Brad. either gonna it's either gonna be really epic or just a big clusterfuck. Um, either it way. looks like it's gonna be super fun. It's gonna be a combination. And of, even yeah. if it is a clusterfuck, that'll just make it even more fun. It'll, it'll be a fun clusterfuck fun. if it's gonna be anything. Yeah, yeah there's. I put the fun in them. cluster fun. No, that doesn't work. <laughs> it almost system, did though. The system I went is, for it. It has a few differences, um, but it's the differences are so awesome. Like the magic system is amazing in OLD. The uh, the alchemy Throw system. Up in Brad's really, mouth. <laughs> that's that's something that some people would probably want to see. And I not count myself in that. Throw in up in Brad's mouth. That was the most delayed reaction ever, Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Look, at this point, Brad Boto is a said. national treasure, and I will not have any harsh words said against that. Yeah, he is. I fucking love he's, that guy. He's my Bambi. He's my Twitch Bambi. I, I, I'm basically his Twitch mum. Have you seen Aww. him stream? He is legitimately awesome. I hate him so much. I know, right? <laughs> He's a dick. How dare he? And he promised to sub to me and he never did. Oh. Oh. That 
that fucking slag. That fucking slag. That's because he's a beta. I don't know why I'm calling him. No, it's just he's too important to bother with small streamers like By the way, Fuzzy, I'm pretty sure you're on your webcam mic, just an FYI. Am I? You sound super far away. That's the one you think you're on. I've moved my microphone over here rather than over here. The acoustics are way different and not better. Right, hang on. It's okay. Um, so yeah, yeah uh, this was, this was a, this was a, a, a very delayed intro to the show, but, um, we've got, um, there's, there's some stuff going on. We've, we've got some stuff going on. The crew of the Black Fang, uh, set out to Volantis to meet with Felix's contact, uh, Kip Bunnigan, who, uh, gave them a, uh, a, a a mission, a job, uh, to to basically rescue the daughter of a very rich individual who is a sort of philanthropist. He's he's sort of invested into a, a colony here on on Volantis, uh, where they're doing uh, studies on prokaya. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, I don't think I can actually remember the name now. Pro kayaking? No, like not pro kayaking. Prokaryotic? Yes, thank you. You're Prokaryotic uh, bacteria, um, and uh, yeah, they're 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 studying that, and um, in this in this strange uh, in this strange environment, pro kayaking. Yes, now we need now I need a waxed kayak emote. Um, <laughs> that'll be the that'll be the twenty four ninety nine one. We gotta we gotta you gotta spend the money to get the kayak. Um, Episode name Procaro what? <laughs> Oh, they make yogurt. <laughs> oh, chat's on point tonight. We got we got oh, yeah, the we got the hucksters out today. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah so um, the uh, the scientist Jeremy Arden, uh, his daughter uh, was uh, well. Ba basically, they got they got shown a a video um, of a very nasty individual um, that was introduced to them as guts, a big warlord type person in the bloody nine who they have in fact had some run-ins with some of guts's crew before um and well it, i mean pretty much every occasion ended up in hostilities and, and horrible things happened um and uh i ba i guess last time we just kind of left off with the group sort of trying to plan out things uh after seeing this video of this of this girl uh, that's apparently been fed like human flesh. Yeah, Pretty she's nasty. sort of being tortured, and we kind of need to get there yesterday. Yeah. So I guess you I guys don't are. Know, though, is she cute? Yeah, she was okay, described as she's, uh, beautiful. So it, rather beautiful. Yeah. Apparently, yeah. she in the description. I don't know if anyone has read any Robert Jordan, but in my mind, she looked like Lanfear. You don't know who Lanfear is? Picture in Marilyn Monroe. Yeah. I pictured oh. Marilyn Manson. I'm not. I'm not a well, giant Robert. I pictured Rosie O'Donnell. I'm not a giant fan of his either, but I did read his, his stuff. <laughs> Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> what the? It's everyone the... has the giggles. What the hell is the matter with us? It's just Everything one of those days. Setting us off. Oh, you're fucking stoned or something. What the hell? <laughs> Fuzzy's the only one that's drinking beer, and she's I not. Know. Fuzzy just gets like super calm when she drinks. It's like the opposite. Yeah, it's like mellowing her that out. That doesn't fucking count, that Peachy. That does not count. I'm, 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 yeah. yeah. That's just painful Z for your Cots, mouth. try again. Jesus, Peachy, shame on you. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm not destroying my liver because we don't live in the world of the future where you can <laughs> I, get a I, grown I, fucking Where you can get a liver. shitty replacement. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've been really good at barely drinking for the past week or so, so I'm... Well, I'm, good, I'm, good. Yeah. You're, sta you're staying with that trend because that's what Corona I, I Light a, is. I had a day yesterday, so today I'm like, fuck <laughs> it. Been not drinking for about three years now. Well, Ooh, nice. So I've got a head start, but you're welcome to join the game and try and catch up. Sure. Oh, okay. Fuck you. Okay, like so. Eleven years I haven't drunk in. I'm just so. working on trying to drink. Water. Not difficult. You just don't <laughs> drink. So. Wax like. So. I'm trying All addictions to do like that. Me. Come, come here, kittens. Come here. Come here, kittens. Come here. Come here, little fairies. Okay. So, uh, you guys uh, were, I guess, preparing for things uh, for this. Um, yeah, we gotta have our meeting. Yeah. 
So we're still at the table with uh, Kip, are we not? Yeah. Yeah. We gotta have our debriefing. Okay. Uh, and you said we're on the planet Regan? Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah, there is not much here. Kip. We looked. Yeah. I've taken some time to do some calculations, and I think that if the girl's safety is the number one priority, then paying the ransom is probably the best bet for her to be safe. Uh, well, I don't know if the Bloody Knight are uh, known for their honesty. Mm. Jeremy's got no problem paying the ransom. The problem is whether or not Justice Felix here suggested if the Bloody Nine are going to keep to the bargain. The plan is to pay the ransom. Okay, that's good for us. Is there any sort of uh, talk of a setup or a trade or location or anything? The time that you see here, and he points to his little readout or whatever, um, he says, is when the first scheduled meetup is. It's in the asteroid belt, uh, the far side of the system. You just meet up with him, or...? We don't have a lot of details, just a location and a time. Hmm. Asteroid belt is not good for us. Lots of places for ships to hide. Yeah. My thinking exactly. Yeah, they could bring any number. Um. Mm. Well, you, know, you can't uh, match the brawn of them, in Bloody Nine. We're gonna have to try and do this stealthily. Uh, I wonder if. Um, how can we do this? Uh, what if we. Is there is our ship known to them? Are we known to them? They probably know of us by now. I just turn to the group. Can, can hey. paint the ship different color? They never know. <laughs> I could don't do that. Maybe I don't we think... could be lent a cloaking device. You get, mm. you get like, you get like this weird like echo of like Arthur's voice in your head, Felix, and it's just like, <laughs> all right, lime green then, lime green then, lime green then, lime yeah, green I, then. I audibly just say, oh, fuck off, Arthur. <laughs> <laughs> huh? I don't Roy. think we've left any survivors when we've run into the D9, so I don't think anyone managed to get a message out about us. I just feel it'd be pretty suspicious for a random group uh, or sect of Bloody Nine to just waltz up and make contact during this time. I feel like they'd be uh, smarter than that. They'd see that coming. You uh, have met them, right? Uh, I've eaten them before, honestly. But that's a story for another day. Look. Uh, you. Oh. They are pretty stupid, is all I'm saying. Yeah, but still, this... Uh, they're still smart enough to get her head, get their hands on her, and set this ransom up. Can't yeah. put too much Boy. by him. I mean, especially when we get all the money if we capture him and save the girl. How are we going to accomplish that? I mean, if we could lure him to a meet and maybe get him and the girl alone, I could easily take him out from a distance. But there's there's no real surefire way as to how to. Get them both in the same spot at one time without getting seen. Mm. Twelve I cinder blocks. <clears throat> I think one option we should consider is using their greed against them. How do you mean? Well, we know they want lots of money. So if we can go and meet with him, perhaps we could convince him to work with us to extort more money. Won't happen. There's no way we're going to convince him to work with some random people. Although Especially when there's so much does. off the table. It's Hawk a lot of money, though. We could use their greed against them and perhaps make us look like we are nothing but a whale floating in space. What if in we need were... of help. What if oh, we were We, to... we know already that they'd like to prey on people who need help. And just rob them blind. Just oh, would be Don't have them. idea. Oh, Tell okay. them we doing cooking show called How uh, to Serve Man. 
I don't know if they'll buy that one, though. It's a good idea. So, I see what Sterling is saying is if we go floating out there before the meeting time looking vulnerable. What if we approach them as, say, a a third-party buyer? What if we approach them with more money saying that we want to buy the girl? Discreet purchase, $30 million. Reasons our own. I feel if uh, maybe they'll, they'll buy that. I don't know. I feel just like if, ideas here. if we want to do it in the safest way, that means we're most likely to take out the threat. I think this plan of action is is better than can being any, straight with him. Can anyone think of how to do a stealthy reconnaissance so that we can get an idea of numbers? Like, if we got a better scanner, we could scan the asteroids, or we borrow a better scanner, we could scan the asteroids to see if it's an ambush with lots of other ships. Well, we're just a little pinched for cash right now. Yeah, but maybe since his daughter's life is on the line... just millions of... God damn it. I, you're not rock, Sterling, but the thing is, for us to make the upgrades to the ship that we want to make, to make this mission as easy as possible, we straight up can't afford it. We'd need, right. we'd, we'd need all the money from the job to be able to outfit the ship. Then the cheapest way would still be uh, the bait. Mm. But in the bait situation, we still need intel. <sighs> Kip, is there anything else you can tell us? Any sort of... Have you had run-ins with uh, with this group, Sect of the Blade Nine, before? I know you've been running this sort of underworld crowd for quite some time. I've anything had, else uh, you can tell us? I've had, a, I've had a few run-ins with the Bloody Nine. Usually, uh, they don't go well. Uh, any kind of deals that I've ever had with them have been, um, well, somebody's died. And you see me here, you know that I got away. But uh, maybe not s- always the case for uh, some of my uh, clients, unfortunately. Um, it's uh, It's been a difficult time. Uh, any Any... Any interaction with the Bloody Nine needs to be taken seriously and with proper precautions. They almost never seem to keep their word, which is why I wanted to bring you in here. Mr. Arden was ready to throw in the 10 million, no problem. But I said, uh, we should have a backup plan. You're them. I don't suppose Mr. Arden has any intelligence equipment, scanners, uh, this small is a scientific ships. Uh... To, to be frank, uh, Mr. Arden has, uh, well, pretty much the remainder of his money is, uh, well, it's been invested into this colony and, uh, the ransom and, and your pay. It's tied up in research. Whew. All right, He's a well, genius. should we go back to the- He'll earn the money back without any problems, but right now, in terms of liquid assets, it's... This is it. I mean, if the Bloody Nine can shake him down for 10 mil, who's to stop uh, all the other fucking creeps out there from trying to pull something else over him? Perhaps we are. We're what? We're what's stopping them. So we need a good plan. Shall we go back to the ship and uh, plan where it's a little more private? Hmm, yes, we should think through this. As well as reach out to our contacts in case they have anything useful. It's worth a shot. Good idea. Mm. I have one idea I'd like to discuss with you, Clicks, when we get back. Sounds good, Hawk. Um, wondering, guys, do you think it'd be worth hiring anybody? Uh, bring it, bring some extra help on to tackle this. It's not a bad idea, Felix. Someone not a bad a idea little, at all. A little stealthy and creepy in the dark, like myself. Sure. Uh, Kip, you, uh, you know quite a few bounty hunters. Yeah, you know anybody who could fit, he, uh... He holds his hand up and he says, I know what you're gonna ask. We'll uh, pay him out of our cut. I gotta be honest with you. You're not the first people that I asked for this. You you're, should have told us up front, Kip. You're the last. Holy fuck. You really went through the whole goddamn sheet? What happened to the d- d- people's? That's hey. how far down the sheet you are, Felix. They said no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They said oh, yeah. no, exactly. Uh, 
Oh, I gotta be honest with you. Killed. Not many want to piss off the bloody nine. Some of them well, still try to do it. Check them. that box. Yeah, I don't know if you could piss them off any more than what we've already done. Well, to be honest, we could definitely piss them off a hell of a lot more. What am I saying? But yeah, we we already got the, the pot stirred, so to speak, with the bloody nine, so we're not too worried about about. You know, Felix, at the very least, we could use an engineer for hire. That's a good idea, and honestly, I'd say this is a hotbed for those fucking smarty science people. Oh, yeah. Good point. Kip, any ideas where we could uh, locate an engineer for hire? Uh, there's definitely plenty of engineers on the planet. Uh, hmm. I don't really know much about the people that are, that work here. I, I was kind of brought in for this, uh, to manage the whole thing. Um, but, uh... I don't really know much about him. Uh, maybe you could, uh, maybe you could speak to one of the uh, administrators. Sure. Any idea where the building is for that? Oh yeah, it's the uh, the tall one in the center of town there. He just kind of like oh. points out. So you can literally see it from where you are. Like it's it's okay. just kind of like a long, thin like uh, tower. Um, not huge, um, but like you know, it rises up above the rest of the buildings. Just like two or three blocks away. Yeah, probably. it has. Yeah. It, it probably has like communication uh, equipment and satellites and stuff on it. Cool, cool. Yeah, All right, I uh, think that's probably the best dishes. bet. I think that's the best bet. We definitely need someone to watch the ship systems if we're going to do anything. Yep. And, an engineer. Uh, huh. At least one. Well. And, uh, look, there's one other thing here. More shit. Yeah. What else? It's a good thing for you. Um, oh. That's Mr. Rare. Arden was... said that if you decided to take the mission, uh, he'd be, uh, willing to, uh, at least for the duration of the mission, um, install a special cloaking device for your ship. Yes. That. That's exactly Worse. what I was hoping for. Okay. How mm. big the cloak? Is it like is it like flippy cloak, but the really big oh, no, no. That go it's, over the ship? It's <laughs> not an actual. Pretty act, much, it's not, long. It's not an actual. Pretty actually. much, and I'm looking at Felix cloak. like nodding and like just lettered. Yes, that's how it works. I just <laughs> quickly purse my lips and just shut up. <laughs> <laughs> just letter, letter. Yeah, it's a. Yeah. Real big cloak. Works like that. You just tie it on to the back of the ship's head. You can't really ever even see it. Oh. Yep, invisible the whole time. We're going to borrow it. That cool. Super cool. <laughs> right. Hawk, is that something you can install? Or does Mr. Arden... Actually, let's find our engineer and see if they can install it. They'll probably install it for us. Anything else, Kip? Where do we got to go to get this uh, fucking upgrade for the ship? Are they just going to come by the, the yard and just start installing. I'm sure they know which one's ours by now. Uh, I'll, I'll have uh, I'll have somebody bring it over to the ship. Um, uh, uh, what kind of power have... system do you have in the ship there? Uh, we got, I look to Hawk, because we got a, we got a really good one, right? Okay, good, because this thing uses I'll up I'll just a... say it was really bad. I don't, yeah. I'll be honest, I don't have a fucking clue how the power okay. system works. Okay. Um, well, so listen, Kip, I gotta, yeah, I gotta be honest like with no you. we have no power. Remember after if, shouting ting and hitting ting with wrench and saying, work you piece or shit work. I, I yeah. think that's some sort of uh, Borean prayer to the god. Mm. <laughs> I, I can buy that. I think that's true. Yeah. Hmm. Well, either way, we got to get it installed, so. Well, let's go get us this engineer and then we'll see if we can... You know, cobble something together. Maybe they got like a. Just, just how much power exactly would it take? Well, I'm I'm not an engineer myself, but uh, on a ship like yours, I can guess what kind of system Felix is running with. Uh, my mm. guess is uh, you're probably not going to be able to run much more, but the cloaking device uh, if it's turned on. Maybe we'll get some oxygen tanks or something. Life support and cloaking would probably be it. We can't scan or fire. We don't need life support. Look, we we load ourselves down with a couple oxygen tanks. We're good. Nothing to worry about. Let's go get an engineer to consult. That's a great idea. It's All right, look. Good idea. Kip, if we need anything else, uh, we'll, you'll be the first we can contact with. And if you could, can you uh, ping us when you're, those fucking engineering dudes are going to install that 
cloaky thing on the ship, just so I don't end up shooting one of them by mistake. Uh, well, listen, they're gonna deliver it. I uh, think we have to. Install yeah. It. Oh, we have to install it. Yeah, we oh, gotta go get an engineer. Well, at least one. I mean, I'll okay. be honest with you, Felix. I, I kind of expected you to have one on a ship uh, without an engineer. That's kind of crazy. Well, what happens we, if something we did. goes wrong okay. with the ship? I we did, and, and now we don't want to talk about it. Yeah, I kind of, kind of supplemented that with this thing, and I kind of just flipped the hood up and just clicked the button on the on the neck, and I just go invisible. <laughs> <laughs> it uh, it makes do, but you're right. And I turn it off. All right, look, I we're gonna put go get- my hood up on my onesie and start walking away. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> hands, hands as in if it does it, like, like, this, this, like a hoodlum. <gasps> Every time, every time you turn that thing on, Monk's just like. <gasps> I feel like I feel like I feel like Glix's onesie probably makes like a like a duck quacking noise or something. Like every time the little <laughs> squeaker is like, the bottom of the feet. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's like the tiniest dog squeakers in the heels or something. Just little duck quacks every step. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. All right, so uh, Kip says, um, all right, well, listen, I got to get back to Mr. Arden, all right? Right. Good we luck. understand. Thank you, Kip. Um, right. Well, let's go to the tower. I think it's probably best if you guys figure this guy, this engineer out. Okay. Probably just end up scaring him away, to be honest. I don't have the best of luck with engineers. Okay. Um... Let's see. How about, well, um, maybe you and Lunk can go back and Lunk can cook us something and maybe Hawk can come with me. Yeah, and... Lunk cook, yeah. Yeah. And maybe Sterling too. What, no, what I, Lunk cook? I've never cooked anything in my life. I don't No, no, no I joke. wasn't saying that. Let's go oh. shopping for an engineer, right. Sterling. Oh. Okay, but no cooking. Look, no cooking. Okay. Sterling cook. Yeah, you, oh. Sterling, you should totally uh, go and learn how to cook. I think it's I don't love think... good teacher. You're, yeah. you're, you're pretty old. You, you, I, you I stay dead stuff. in the eye, you're Felix. Don't make me go back there. <laughs> love good teacher, though. Love know how to ting. What you do is you get a bit of bread and you get to add a bit of bread and you go, you is an idiot sandwich. And then you go, you donkey, do the ting, yeah. That's an overrun specialty, actually. So. Yeah, idiot so, sandwich. So engineers. Yeah. yeah, let's go to the engineer <laughs> place. I, I really feel like I, that's where I want to go right now. Oh, okay. All right then, let's go. And I'm just gonna start walking off to that building because it sounds like it's pretty close. Sure. Um. So yeah, he directed you to an administration building. It's not necessarily like the engineer building. It's, right. Uh, it's like a, yeah, it's yeah. administration. They might help you find some engineers. Exactly. Uh, um. <laughs> sure. Okay. So uh. Yeah. You guys probably walk for like ten minutes or so, and uh, you make it to the to the building. Uh. Outside. Again, it, it, these are all sort of like prefab sort of structures. Uh. So very similar to the way that like Mass Infect uh, Andromeda, um. Uh, structures kind of look. Um, sort of like rounded corners and and uh, and rectangular and such. The, the, the smell of rushedness and 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 the taint of VA. I'm not bitter. You're bitter. <laughs> um. So the uh yeah the outside of the the building um it's probably like open air like there's probably just like um the doors are probably like an art there's probably like an archway and it's like a double door situation that's just kind of open. Um, like I said, it's it's very like nice like climate out like it's 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 very comfortable, um, and um, and uh, yeah they're they're just l- like leaving it open, um, and I- inside there is uh, like a uh, sort of like a semicircle kind of uh, desk with uh, some kind of um, receptionist or or something like in the front, um, probably like we'll say like a, a male uh, Venetian. Um, probably there um you know uh light glinting off of his bald head um <laughs> and um yeah he's uh wearing like a probably like all white um kind of kind of outfit um you know just very like clean cut and and um sort of like business casual um 
and uh, there's like there's like like fake plants and stuff around the around like the the lobby here. Um, and uh, he looks up from like a hollow screen, and uh, he says, "Hello." What so I feel I like I'm you? adjusting my wig a little more than I normally would when I see his his shining head. Yeah, and you can see like he furrows his brow at you. Like yeah, and again, it sees my ears. Yeah, for Venetians, it's like really, really, like really weird to like wear a wig. Like they see yeah. it like this is very peculiar. Uh huh. Yeah, this is odd, odd Venetian behavior. Ha- Hi. Hi. <clears throat> um, I'm Science Officer Glix of the Black Fang. Um, me and my companions, and I make a, a, a stupid hand gesture, Hello. are um seeking to hire uh, a couple of, well, engineers for an upcoming mission that we have. Would you happen to know how we might um, acquire some some help? Or even an engineering droid. That would be great. Hello, I am Administrator Bilthon. Interesting attire. And you can see, like, he's plainly staring at your wig. And he says, um, he says, uh, probably something like under his breath, like, uh, that you guys probably hear is like, um, Boba Chai, which Glicks, you would translate to, like, um, it's, it's like a, it doesn't translate, like, perfectly from Venetian, uh, mm-hmm. to common, but it's something along the lines of, like, um, it, it's like a it's like an expression that like older Venetians use to talk uh, talk to young Venetians, sure. um, because like the elders of the Venetians are like highly regarded, and it's mm-hmm. almost like Japanese kind of culture, like sure, where, you know, way more use, Western yeah, or yeah. Uh, Eastern culture rather. Yeah, yeah. Um, and uh, it, it, it's it's just like him automatically sort of differentiating you two like like saying like okay you're a little kid what the hell are you you know what yep. are you doing here why are you bothering me yep and i am yeah. i mean i'm a very young venetian yeah so i kind of dip my head a little bit and look down at my my space onesie and kind of just push the wig back a little bit i feel like i do feel a little bit ashamed because i don't see a lot of venetians <clears throat> yeah so we just Need some help. We, yeah, engineering droid, or, uh, you know, living engineer work too. Pretty uh, much the same thing, really. Yeah. What kind of engineer are you looking for? Ships engineer. Space ones. Mm. I mean, yeah, ship. Very well. I will search for uh, someone with those kinds of qualifications. I will notify them of your pending arrival, and you may speak with them. Please Let, be... It's a, it's a decently paying position, too, so just make sure that's noted there when you go looking. Frankly, that's not my job. I'm just going to pass on there. Well, I don't... Look, I, that's enough. You do what you need to do. I'm just going to stare at here. I look at Felix like, you need a fish sandwich. You better step back. He's <laughs> angry. <laughs> Um, so he, yeah, um, so he, he says, uh, it'll be a moment. In feeling, I just say fucker under my breath. (laughs) It it sounds just like, uh, just like purrs, pretty much. It sounds like... You're lucky he doesn't, he doesn't understand. Yeah, not many, I don't think many people do. (laughs) Thank good. (laughs) Um, okay, so after uh, a minute or two, he says, Ah, there. Very well. Uh, it appears that um, there are some uh, ship engineer, capable engineers uh, located. Hmm. Uh, there's one to the west and uh, one to the north. Um, and and he's, you can see like he's looking through the list. How much qualification do you need? 
Um, well, they would have to have at, at least, least be been a, a ship's engineer for, I don't know, guys, what would you say? Two years experience? <clears throat> oh, Bobby, you're muted. About 20 years worth. Uh, we need someone who knows what they're doing. Uh, uh, or we okay. could just get a Borean. Or a Borean. I, that too. But basically, if you could just give us a list, I, I can send the messages on my pad. Look, I'm not being racist. They just are very good at engineering. That's they really I, I understand, Sterling. I'm not suggesting that other people couldn't do engineering. It's just when you see a Borean, you think, that man's got a spanner. Just turn to Hawk and whisper, what set him off? I have no idea. I think he's doing what's called virtue signaling. Yeah. It's a thing humans do. It's I'm silly. looking at, <clears throat> at you guys, like at the three of you guys, like I'm just so ashamed right now. This this is an elder Venetian. <laughs> I, I can't believe this is happening. Just, yeah, just, just the list. That's all we need. Um... Very well. Uh, I'm also checking on the um, on the droid depot as well. Uh, How very kind of you. Thank you. As you as you would expect from an elder, Baba Chai. I'm just bowing my head. Um, and you guys, uh, an asshole. Like Baba Chai doesn't have it doesn't have like any negative connotations to it, right? It's it, like probably like child. Probably from like anybody that's not like uh, a Venetian, no. they would see it like as as like condescending. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. If you're Venetian, it's just kind of like expected. It is what it is. Uh, I, I move closer to Glicks. I perk up a little bit. <laughs> Hello, Glick. I put like a hand around you. I feel like nothing else is moving, but when that little bit of air release goes, my wig goes. That's <laughs> 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 the only thing that moves. <laughs> and I just stand there and blink. Um, yeah, so, um, uh, he says, uh, hold up your data pad. Here you go. Um, yeah, and he just kind of, he, like, flicks the information, like, towards your data pad. And you get, like, a little pop-up. Nice. Will you accept this? Tran Whoop. Transfer. Yes. Whoop. Transferring now. Oh, excellent. Thank you. Wow, guys, look, and I show Hawk. Look at here. We'll just send this one a message and this one. A yeah, you get like a little. You get like a little map of the um, of the uh, the colony here, and um, it's just got like a. Uh, it's just got like blips um, for the locations, just like little indicator lights. Sure. And then uh, is he looking up the droid stuff, or is that on here too? Um, he sent that as well. Sweet. It's just like one building that's got like it's like a probably like a droid manufacturer. Like it's a droid truck. depot. Yeah, droid depot. Yeah. Sweet. Uh, right. Well, who wants to go to the droid? De oh, Hawk. Would you? Would you like to go see about droids? Why would you think that I'd want to do that, Clicks? Um, because you are well, because made. You are a machine. You're a droid. You are literally thought, a machine. I thought that you might have a good eye for um the mechanical I don't efficiency. have eyes. Oh, I thought they may have a good scanner for the mechanical. I started talking way too fast because he's made me nervous. Mechanical efficiency of other <laughs> droids. Look, it's not racist. He is <laughs> a machine. You made a joke again. <laughs> and I elbow him and it really hurts. <laughs> I'm like, oh. Here's oh. Clang. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's going to be Right bruise. on the funny bone. Oh, yeah. I might have chipped my elbow. Okay. Uh, you know he's made a uh, so right, how about Hawk and I go see about the droids? You guys want to see about the, who, these other guys? And I, uh, I, uh, I want to bump somebody else's data pad because I feel like there's definitely a bump feature. I don't have the fling feature, but I can like bump, and they'll get the data. Yeah, I, I kind of reactively 
pull my data pad out and get included in the bump to get the information as well. Uh, uh, I'm going to be honest. It's probably best if uh, I go with Hawk and pick out a droid because sure. I might maybe possibly give the wrong impression to any potential engineers. Okay. Well, Kinda I tell you what. Today. For the uh, non-droid engineers, I think I'm just going to ping them and then tell them they can come to the ship if they were interested in the job. Uh, Lunk, do you have any sandwiches on you? Lunk is back Lunk, at the Yeah, Lunk, ship. Lunk's gone. Lunk's, Lunk's is making, making sandwiches. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Lunk is not making sandwiches. Lunk is making something much more interesting. Oh, nice. Much more extravagant. She's leveling up her... It's a triple oh, decker sandwich. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Souffle, motherfuckers. Uh, can, I, can I check my robe, see if I've got any sandwiches left over? From when Lunks constantly gives us sure. packed lunches. Sure, for, give me go, go ahead and give me your luck dice, please. Your luck dice pool. Okay, um, one screen. <laughs> and while he's doing this, I don't think. Oh there's my god, I can't even situation. see the sheet. Let me pop this. <laughs> I don't think there's ever a situation where Felix would ever even potentially roll for leftover food. <laughs> Whenever he gets it, it's gone. <laughs> it's just instantly. It's a two d six, Peachy. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> it, it's the smallest thing ever. Yeah, but that's what she said. Well, oh, to me, she didn't. Damn. She just laughed. Oh. <laughs> Sad. Uh, a four. Uh, yeah, you have no sandwiches. Oh, damn it. Yes, we have no bananas. <laughs> I tried, Felix. I tried. Yeah, yeah, you sure did. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the ship and see what Lunk's cooking up, and I'm gonna message these uh, engineers. Let me know what you guys find at the droid depot. Sounds good. Let's go, Huck. Okay. Sterling, you wanna come with up? me? Uh, well, we'll walk this time. Have a good day, Baba Chai, and watch yourself. Thank you. And I just scurry off. Mm. So, so, like, what does this Bubba Chai mean? So, and, and just oh. just another thing, like, watch yourself in a Venetian is like a really uh, common like um, uh, like uh, parting uh, saying. It means like many many different things. It's like uh, pay attention to how you're acting. It's like a parent saying that to a kid. It's like yeah, you know, like okay, don't don't fuck around, it's don't misbehave. Like, be safe. Yep. Take care. Don't insult anyone. <laughs> Lick both ways. Yep. Yep. Have you Stranger eaten? TV. Oh my Polite. god, are you starving to death? Wash yep. behind your ears. Know what the weather's gonna be. <laughs> mm. How would that help? Take a jumper with I'll you. Take a jet. Don't eat yellow <laughs> snow. Make sure you've yep. got an umbrella. It's just an awareness a reminder, like, us. remember to be mindful. Don't be an But it's patronizing though. as fuck, though. Let's be yeah, honest. but I'm probably oh, like so used man. to it that it doesn't. It just you know, it's, it's culturally part of Vene- ingrained. Yeah, it's part of Venetian culture. Yeah. So yeah, I definitely I have not been around Venetians for a while, so you definitely see like the, the bowing and scurrying. Um, okay, uh, Sterling, you coming with me or are you going to the Droid Depot? Yes. That's not an answer, Sterling. <laughs> I just are you playing you. Candy Crusher on your? You are on your data pad. Give me that. I, I, but no, I still have yeah, three lives left. No, I uh, no, I don't knew don't it. use a gem. Oh. oh, do you know how long Glicks it took me to farm that gem? Well, you know, if you just pay a couple of you credits. have meddled with power far beyond your ken. <laughs> <laughs> Grab it back, off you. Come with me. Okay, I'm gonna head back to the ship. Okay, fair enough. Um, so you're heading back to the ship? Yeah, so I'm going to head back to the ship. Instead of like going to three different places, I'm actually going to message these dudes and have them come to the ship. Like a job interview sort of thing. And just see okay. who responds. Okay, yes. fair enough. Not a problem. Um, very well. So you head off. Uh, and Felix and Hawk and, uh, are headed towards the depot. What about Lunk? Lunk is currently busy julienning vegetables and just Ooh. 
It's 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 there's there's, there's all kinds of crazy. But it's luck. So you're just going. You're Julian, and you're Julian. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. When it comes to kitchen shit, Lunk is like. She knows all the words. She read the book and memorized it. Yeah, it's probably like scary efficient too. Like you don't expect an ogron to move that deftly, but she does. She's fucking. She's like some sort of. She's precise kitchen ninja. And then if the there's, like, if oh. there's like, if you had to have like a paper copy of the Ogron like cookbook, it'd be like, like four thousand pages because all of like the, <laughs> all of like the translated like <laughs> text is like yeah. really descriptive right pictures. It, it, Ogrons tend to do oral histories, right? They, they not much for the writing, so it's all memorized. And a lot like, of pictures. I like to think like, <laughs> are so fucking dumb because they've got to memorize a lot of shit and it leaves no good thinking. Uh, absolutely. Yeah, she looks like a Ginsu commercial. Like, <laughs> her knives are perfect and sharp. Yeah. But yeah, um, so, so basically the kitchen is just a, a roiling mass of deliciousness right now. Okay, fair enough. So yes, uh, you guys are all off and let's take our first five minute break. We'll be right back in five minutes. Stay tuned, everybody, for some more Turn Order Warped episode number 30 as the group prepares for what could be a very profitable or very dangerous or even both mission. Let's find out. We'll be right back. Profitable. 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 That's 